Hi everybody, this is Joel from Spotterhome Paris and Spotterhome.com. Today we're visiting a three bedroom flat in Malakoff, which is on right on the border of the southern part of the city of Paris. And this is very well, um, um, this is well really located when it comes to transportation. It's right next to the tramway, which is a line for C, uh, T3A that goes all around Paris. And there's also the line 4 metro that goes from uh, north to south. The line 4 is uh, about 15 minutes walk from here but you can catch a lot of buses just uh, underneath the building, just right on the uh, outside the building. You catch a lot of buses that goes to Paris and on the other di direction as well. So you're on also, when it comes to airport links, you're uh, on the right way to Orly Airport, which is south of Paris. So uh, on a taxi or on a bus, that's really easy to get to. And when it comes to uh, daily shopping and uh, commodities, um, it's everything around here at the tip of your fingers. So there's a big supermarket just actually kind of like in the same building it's just downstairs and there's also a sports shop there's a lot of uh, there's a lot of shops everywhere there's a bakeries there's a um, there's grocery stores uh, groceries as well and there's also also um, this um, big sports shop this is called Decathlon it's um, I think it, it's, it's in the UK as well it's right outside as well there's a lot of restaurants a lot of cool bars to hang out this flat is actually on the third floor of this uh, building and there's two lifts in the flat in the building. Let me show you. At the moment, the flat is um, occupied by um, by um, three people who are sharing a room, so there's a lot of personal things, so we'll have to overlook that. Um, you, first and foremost, you can see the, the door is very secure. So there's about three, uh, four locks, sorry, on here. There's four points uh, locks, so one, two, three, four, five, even five. There's an, eye, uh, an eyepiece as well, allows you to see who's coming, and there's a lot of... Um, there's a lot of uh, storage space. That's what I like about um, 80s building. Buildings have been, been built in 70s and 80s because they just have a lot more storage than more recent ones. So that's all storage. I'm not going to open it because there's a lot of personal belongings in it, in, uh, in, in, in uh, all the storage spaces. So here, you can see the living room, first of all. It's like the, it's, uh, I think it's one of the biggest, maybe the biggest space in the, in the flat. This flat is 95 meters square, by the way, so it's a, uh, it's on, you know, it's quite big. It's quite big. Uh, so there's a, there's a couch here. There's a coffee, coffee table as well. There's a unit for a TV and etc. The TV is not, uh, is not, doesn't come with the flat. It's, um, it's the tenant, so it's, go it's going away. All of that as well. But there's a, the unit for it. There's a lot of, uh, of uh, plugs everywhere. If you want to, you know, like have like. Uh, electric guitar like so there's a there's a there's a lamp as well uh, there's also you can see first um, when you come in that there's a lot of light coming in so all the whole of the this side of the wall is like there's no wall actually it's all a window so this is like a fixed window and then there's like a what they call a French door like the glass door basically a glass double door that goes that links directly to the balcony here and you can see you're in the center of the the city of Malakoff which is kind of like part of Paris. The uh, balcony is rather big, so you can clearly have like a, like so, a table and, uh, and have dinner or whatever lunch in here on here. It's like the, your own little picnic. Uh, the windows, as you can see, um, come with curtains to uh, block a bit of light and to have a bit of privacy. You can see the, um, the electrical heater behind the door here. So the, the, the whole flat is electrically heated. There's a door as well in the, in the lounge with four, four or five chairs, five chairs. And, um, and there's a door that links directly to the kitchen as well. So you can come in to the kitchen through here and through the corridor over there. So the kitchen is fully equipped. There's a lot of storage space, as you can see, everywhere. Uh, there's, a, there's a lot of things that come with it. Uh, there's a washing machine, there's an oven, there's electrical hub, there's double sink, there's chopping boards, there's a big fridge and a freezer compartment as well. There's um, a lot of cutlery and plates. Uh, there's a rice cooker, a kettle. Frying pans, saucepans, etc., mugs, cups, there's everything. Salad bowls, oven trays. There's also a heater in the kitchen, and there's another glass door that leads also to the balcony. Same balcony we've just uh, seen, right? So, all of that is storage space. You can see there's uh, quite a lot, and there's a vent as well here in the kitchen. So, I think that's it for the kitchen. Let's move on. On the right hand side here through that door you find uh, the second part of the corridor that leads to the bathroom toilet and the three rooms so here there's the boiler uh, closet so you can put the brooms and the and the hoover there's a hoover actually that comes with the flat as you can see on the, the next door on the right hand side is the toilet so the toilet's quite straightforward there's the toilet and the and the vent 
and the space to hang your um, your paper. That's pretty it. And on the left hand side, you can find the first bedroom. I think it's maybe the biggest one uh, uh, out of uh, out of those. So the um, mattress that's on here doesn't um, doesn't come with the flat. It's the tenant. There's uh, there are three beds that you know. There's one bed for each room. But uh, yeah, they're, they're not in the flat at the moment, but they, they, they're available, uh, you know, if you, if you want them. Um, so there's two singles and one, one double, I think, uh, the beds. So here uh, you get also this desk is staying here. That's, that's, that comes with the flat. Uh, I think it's quite handy because you, have a, you, you get a shelf and then you get a like, working space down, down here. And this as well, the clo clothes horse comes with it as well. Um, there's th those uh, two of those uh, three bedrooms have this little patio balcony thing. I think it's very clever because you can have um, you can actually like chill like you can be outside, but also in the winter you can have the sensation that you're outside, but you're actually you know not cold because all of that closes with the sliding windows and that opens on the um, you can see it's uh, the avenue the, um, it's the big avenue in Malakoff it's the city center so you can see all those uh, shops there's a bar, the bar here there's a bushery there there's a there's a beauty salon there's a, a gas station and all of that restaurants etc there's a big supermarket just there in the building as I, as I mentioned earlier and there's more over there pizza places etc so uh, it's very well located so next up we'll see the bathroom Actually, before that, you'll see those uh, big storage spaces in here behind those bypass doors. So there's another over here and you see there's a lot of hanger space and shelves. And there's actually a lot more storage space than the three tenants needed. You can see all of that is pretty much empty. There's a lot and a lot of storage spaces. I'll never, I'll never say that enough. Um, so here is the bathroom on the left hand side, on the right hand side, sorry. Um, it's lino as well as the rest of the flat. This is like looks like wood based lino, and um, so it's really easy. I mean, it's not you know it's not fragile or anything. It's really easy to clean. Um, so in the bathroom, you find a bathtub like a full size one with a shower curtain. Uh, there's a vent up there. The, around the bathroom, it's all tiled up so to protect the the water the wall sorry from the water splashes. Um, here you find a basin as well. You find one of those. I don't know what you call them. There's a big mirror there with five uh, five bulbs. It's very bright in here. A couple uh, electrical plugs and behind the door you find hangers as well for towels etc. And um, electrical heater. And um, that doesn't come with the flat. You have to get your own. And uh, yeah, that's it for the bathroom. Let's see the second bedroom. Second bedroom is slightly um, uh, smaller than the other one. Um, there, let's say this one uh, comes with a single bed as well. As I said, those beds don't come with the flat. The tenants are, uh, you know, living with those. Uh, I think the bedside table is saying though. Um, what I have to say about this flat, uh, this sorry, this uh, bedroom, it's really bright. It's uh, you know, it's, uh, all the walls are really clean and white. There's a big window. I mean, couple big windows. There's this casement window here and another double one here. And it's uh, you know, you have the view on the same side as the other one. So no surprise there. You've seen it all. And obviously you can close you can close all of that if you uh, don't want the light you can close this and more here so you know you won't be you can't be really uh, afraid of not managing to managing to sleep also there's that as well it's another an another uh, set of shutters i think that's for outside so you can just roll them down and you block the light completely last but not least third bedroom i think this one is the smallest and um, and yes, yeah, it's, it's the same kind of like setup as um, as the first one with the, you know the patio space and with those glass uh, those glass doors sliding uh, windows here and uh, yeah at the moment uh, there's um, a lot of things but you can easily imagine it when it's um, when it's uh, free you know when it's not occupied at the moment it's, it looks a bit dark as well just because the tenant put some sheets or some curtain I don't know what it is that's blocking the the, the wall of the light but it's um, it's actually as bright as the others pretty much and you have an electrical uh, heater as well and the balcony space as the, uh, with the other one but this one has a lot of stuff at the moment on it so it's not really not much to see but you can actually see um, the actual space you know so it's, it's, uh, it's really nice all right well I've covered it all now I'll give you another overview of the flat real quick here is the first bedroom and the kitchen. 
and the entrance with the with the storage space, the living room and the balcony. All right, thanks for watching guys. This was George from Spotterhome Paris and spotterhome.com. Bye bye.